Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ya akhwati al azizat. This is Ustada Nadia Johnson, your Mu'allima of Lugha Arabiya online. Uh, I want to tell you that I've been watching the enrollments and I'm really happy that many of you are signing up for the free courses. Alhamdulillah, I have been watching your enrollments and watching your progress as well. So, um, you can comment at any time or email me at any time any questions that you have about the courses that you're taking and, and I'll be happy to answer your questions inshallah ta'ala. So I know today is one of our days uh, for study on the group. However, I'm having some computer issues. Uh, like for the last week, I've been having some computer issues. So I did want to leave you with at least this dars, inshallah, uh, for today, Yomul Jum'ah. And this dars is about al jumlatul ismiyah. Al jumlatul ismiyah. Al jumlatul ismiyah. So in Lugha Arabiya, um, we have the concept of al jumla. Al jumla. Al jumla is a sentence. It's a full idea. Mathalan, if I say to you Aisha, Aisha, Aisha. Okay. Maybe you get a picture in your mind of, of somebody you know named Aisha, but I'm not telling you anything about her. But if I say, Mathalan, Aisha Jamilatun, Aisha is pretty, now you have a full idea. This is what we call Al Jumla or Al Jumlatul Mufida. Uh, if you're going into the beginner's Arabic course, you will definitely want to memorize these examples, inshallah. Uh, now, you know, I'm very big on new words <laughs> so uh, these words might be new for you or they might be a review I'm gonna give you eight sentences eight Jumal and I will count them and also put them uh, either above or under the uh, the video inshallah for the translation number one El waladu sagheerun El waladu sagheerun. The boy is small. El waladu sagheerun. El waladu, repeating, sagheerun. Rakam ithnen. El baytu kabirun. El baytu kabirun. I hope you're repeating. El baytu, the house, kabirun is big. El Beitu Kabirun Rakum Thaletha El Jamalu Tawilun The camel is tall. El Jamalu Tawilun Repeat again El Jamalu Tawilun Rakum Arba El Himaru قصير الحمار قصير The donkey is short الحمار قصير رقم خمسة Number five المسجد قريب المسجد Qareebun. The masjid is nearby. El masjidu Qareebun. Rakam sitta. El mat'amu Ba'idun. El mat'amu The restaurant. Ba'idun is far away. El mat'amu بعيد الرجل غني The man is rich الرجل غني الرجل غني ثمانية الطالب the key the student is smart a talibu the key 
الطالب ذكي Now, before I post the Arabic sentences, uh, I'd like you to try to go through this video again, see if you can listen and write. Okay, just try, just try to listen and write. Now, uh, I will give you a hint about the writing. So, all of the words that I used had one long sound. All of the descriptive words that I used, صغيرون, um, small. Kabirun, big. Tawilun, tall. Qasirun, short. Qaribun, close. Ba'idun, far away. Ghaniyun, rich. Vakiyun, intelligent. What sound, what elongating sound do you hear in those, all of those words? Kabirun, Sagirun, Qasirun, Ba'idun. Nam, you hear? Kesra, yeah. Yeah, the letter yeah. E. Long E sound. So when you listen again the second time with a pen and paper, to write, don't look in the Google Translate, don't look in Medina book, <laughs> just try. I want you to remember that, okay? Also, second thing is to hear the difference between seen and sought. Seen, sought. So, مثلاً, the word masjid, masjid, seen or sought, seen. Masjid. مثلا uh, the word قصيرون. Uh, قصيرون. Seen or sawed? Sawed. You heard my tongue go up and it's heavy. قصيرون. Also, difference between تاء and طاء. مثلا the word بيت. بيت بيت تاء or طاء تاء but the word مطعم مطعم with عين مطعم طاء the restaurant مطعم so inshallah I will post the uh, Arabic uh, spelling tomorrow so you have one day inshallah to try to try to listen and write bi'ithnillah as an as a normal imla inshallah which we will be doing in beginners arabic if you'd like to join that uh, inshallah uh, you can follow the link and sign up for beginners arabic it will be starting march 2nd it will be an independent course with five face-to-face uh, -face webinars with me in zoom inshallah so we'll be meeting every other week to um, have speaking exercises with you and your classmates as well as going over the new words and I'll be helping you to develop your um, your speaking, your new words, your reading and your writing skill so inshallah I'll post the Arabic spelling tomorrow and I would like for you to try today to listen and write see you next time inshallah Assalamu alaikum.